my name is Jesse Ryan. I am the number one Mellow Mushroom super fan slash Mellow Mushroom pizza baker. Well, I was originally from Naples, Florida. I was lived there for 20 years and then moved to Georgia right after a concert. Me and my wife would go out of town, we'd go to concerts and do this kind of stuff. Like, And as soon as we'd go, I'd get the phone book out and start looking at all the pizza places in there, trying to find one that I'd never heard of or eaten at. So in Athens, Georgia, I come across one called Mellow Mushroom, which just totally made me stop and say it out loud because it was so eye-catching and different. And we had a pizza delivered, and the guy came with long hair, no shoes on, brought us our food, and uh, from that moment on, I was hooked. From the moment we opened the box, it's like I knew that I had to eat that all the time. The first one I walked into was the original Powers Ferry location. It was an absolute hole in the wall. But again, the people, the food, the atmosphere was fantastic. It was like even better than when we opened the box originally and saw the pizza. And uh, we went to that location probably 250 times before it relocated to a bigger, better building. I've been to 89 Mellow Mushrooms. I mean, with Mellow Mushroom, it becomes so different that it becomes a way of life. It is a lifestyle, it is a fashion, it is craft pizzas and craft beers, and you can't find this anywhere else. It's a pretty cool little thing to have going, to all come together and still uphold one standard, but all be so unique in their style. Well, it was at an opening party. I had already been to 47 Mellows, so I'd seen it and been there and done that. And uh, I was telling this guy how much I loved Mellow, and he was just sitting at the table next to me and explaining to him how many I'd been to and how each one was different and unique, but it still you know, had good food and a good vibe. And he just happened to be the guy that was one of the founders of Mellow Mushroom. He loved it, he loved it. And then the table on the other side of me was the art department of Mellow Mushroom. One person said I was like the number one fan, and then someone else said I was like a super fan, and then the guy who founded Mellow Mushroom said I was like the number one Mellow Mushroom super fan, which when the guy who founds the restaurant calls you that, you run with it. Before I worked here, I was running a small cleaning service that grew to be a pretty good amount of work and um, it paid very, very well, but it was not fun at all. It was not pizza. I mean, he uh, had reached out and everybody was kind of cautious. We were all really nervous about hiring him. It, it, it was a lot harder than I originally thought it was gonna be but it was so much fun. I mean, it is like literally making pizzas and getting paid to do it. And I mean, there is nothing more satisfying than seeing this gorgeous pizza go out and watching people eat it. And you know, giving you the thumbs up and the okay as they're, you know, put into pizza zen. And Jesse could tell you, it isn't easy to learn how to make pizza. You know, until recently, I hadn't spent a lot of time behind the lines there and I've been with the company for a while, and it, it, is, it is hard to get that ticket time right. You know, the difficulty of it just kind of went away easily because of that, because it's just my sheer passion for it. And he's done nothing but keep us in, in stitches and happy, and he is great with direction, and so it's, it's really good to have Jesse on this team and to have his passion of it, like he loves it. Like if, if he messes up a pie, he is seriously shaken because he had to waste it. <laughs> <laughs> he doesn't want to do that, <laughs> and, it, and it makes me happy to see to see him happy and to see the love that he puts into his product. It's, it's a job. It's like everything now. It's it's pretty much everything. It feeds me, pays me, clothes me. It's everything. <laughs> <laughs>